Message coming in, Commander. Big surprise, the Alliance needs you again. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett with Alliance Command. We've got a mission for you. An Alliance officer named Major Kyle has set up a small compound in the Hulking Hedda Cluster. He's attracted a number of followers, mostly biotics. He's become an outspoken critic of the Alliance, and we believe he's mentally unstable. This could be trouble, Shepard. I'll look into it. Three days ago, we sent two Alliance representatives to meet with him at his compound. They've disappeared. We believe Kyle and his followers killed them. That compound is a cult, Shepard. They call him Father Kyle now. He set himself up as some kind of religious leader. You said his followers were biotics? Yes. Major Kyle never showed any biotic tendencies himself, though. I think he's just latched onto a group he identifies with. Many biotics feel marginalized or ostracized by society. Kyle probably sees them as victims who need his protection. And they see him as someone who will fight for them. Unfortunately, he's convinced them that the Alliance is somehow responsible for all their problems. We can't let him go on like this. What were those Alliance representatives going to talk to Major Kyle about? They wanted to bring him back to an Alliance facility for treatment. Major Kyle served us faithfully for many years. We weren't going to abandon him. Given his state of mind, however, he probably saw them as a threat. We're almost certain he had his followers killed him. What else can you tell me about Major Kyle? He used to be a model soldier, but something happened to him at Torfin. Too many Alliance soldiers died under his command. He couldn't cope with the guilt. His psych evaluations showed he couldn't handle the stress of command anymore. He was given an honorable discharge in early retirement. We'd hoped he would get better in time, but we underestimated how far gone he was. Now it looks like it's too late. I might be able to end this without violence. That may not be possible, Commander. We don't want a bloodbath, but Kyle is dangerous. I'll trust you to use your judgment. Hack it out.
into position. This is a private sanctuary. Outsiders are not welcome here. I need to talk to the man in charge. It's important. Father Kyle wants nothing more to do with the Alliance. I want this to end peacefully. If he doesn't see me, people could get hurt. We won't let you take Father Kyle away. He protects us. We need him. The Alliance wants someone to pay for those murders. Let me speak to Major Kyle and maybe I can find some way to help you all get out of this alive. Wait. Father Kyle will speak with you. Head to the building at the far end of the compound. He'll meet you there. The Alliance wants to wipe us out. Father Kyle told us. I am Major Kyle. I know why you've come. We have no quarrel with you. Why can't you just leave us alone? What happened to those other Alliance officers? The ones who came before me? They wanted to take me away from here. They wanted me to abandon this place, turn my back on my family. They spoke blasphemy. I did what I could to make their end quick and painless. I had no other choice. It was necessary to protect my children. Only I can keep them safe. The Alliance sent me to bring you in, Major. Can't you see this has gotten out of hand? Don't you understand you are endangering your followers? I respect that you have come under a banner of peace, but I cannot do as you ask. If you take away their father, my children will be helpless. You ordered your followers to kill those Alliance investigators. You must face the consequences of your actions. Do you really want your children to suffer for your sins, too? No. This... this was my fault. My children are innocent. Pure. Please. I never meant for this to happen. I... I'm sorry. You're doing the right thing, Major. Your children will be better off for it. Come on. Wait, if my children see you taking me away, they won't understand. They will attack and you will be forced to kill them all. You have shown me the error of my ways, Commander. Now you must give me time to explain it to them. It is the only way they will understand. Please, give me one hour. After that, I will meet the Alliance authorities at the gates of my compound and surrender without violence. I give you my word. I'm gonna trust you. If you betray that trust, you and all your children will suffer. I will not betray you, Commander. Thank you for this. Joker can have the Fifth Fleet pick Major Kyle up. I just hope you know what you're doing, Commander. Message coming in. Patching it through. Admiral Hackett here, Commander. Your helmsman just forwarded your report on Major Kyle. We sent in a team as you instructed. Kyle's followers have disbanded, and the Major surrendered to us without incident. We'll make sure he gets the help he needs. To be honest, Shepard, I thought this thing was going to end in a bloodbath. 
I don't know how you did it, but you saved a lot of lives. Congratulations. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Shepard, this is Admiral Kahoku. I found out who set that trap for my men. The ones killed by the Thresher War. Damn, I hope you get this message. It was a group called Serpers. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, highest level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments, trying to create some kind of super soldier. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. This is... This is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. I need to disappear before they find me.
Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, I'm glad you're in the area. We've got an emergency situation, and you're the only one I can trust to get the job done. How can I help, Admiral? Biotic fanatics have hit a medical research station with a psychotropic drug. The drugs have temporarily driven researchers crazy, and the biotics are effectively using them as human shields. So if I shoot everything that moves, a lot of researchers are gonna die. Exactly. A normal team could handle the biotics, but a lot of innocent researchers would die during the operation. That's why I contacted you. I'm hoping you can keep the casualties to a minimum. I'll take the biotics down, Admiral, and I'll try to limit the casualties. I know you will, Commander. I'm sending you the station coordinates now. Fifth lead out. Looks like this vessel was abandoned. Most of the systems seem to be disabled. Only basic life support appears to be functioning. What was that? Is there someone else on this ship? Somebody set that trap. The whole place could be wired. Looks like that machine is keeping him alive. I do not see any brain activity on the readouts. He is dead. This body is just an empty shell. Leave him alone until we know more about what's going on here. You are right. Better to just leave him be for now. Jacob's not going to make it. His brain was deprived of oxygen for too long. There's nothing any of us can do for him now except let him die with dignity. It's what he would want. I'm more worried about Julia now. She's showing signs of severe depression. I gave her some meds that should help, but I better warn the captain. Jacob is showing no signs of brain activity. There's nothing more we can do for him. He wouldn't want to be kept alive by machines, so we're going to disconnect the life support. Dr. Smith is worried about Julia's reaction, though. She can't seem to let Jacob go. The stress is making her implants flare up, causing intense migraines. It'll probably be easier for everyone if we don't tell her until after we shut the life support down. Give her a chance to... Julia, what are you doing here? Why are you...
That was the compassionate thing to do, Shepard.
Message coming in. Patching it through. Good work, Commander. You took down the biotics with minimal collateral damage. I'm sorry we lost some of the researchers, Admiral. The biotics knew what they were doing. Nobody could have gotten out of there with fewer innocent lives lost. You saved a lot of lives today, Commander. Fifth fleet out. Looks like Cerberus has other bases on this world, Commander.
get me next time. I wonder what horrors Cerberus will have waiting for us at the next base. that much. Oh, Goddess. It's Admiral Kahoku. Cerberus must have tracked him down.
Transmission coming in, Commander. I think you're going to want to hear this one. Greetings, Commander Shepard. I represent a party interested in obtaining information on Cerberus activities. Who are you, and who do you represent? Who I am is inconsequential. Suffice to say, I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. You see, Admiral Kahoku contacted my employer looking for information on the location of any Cerberus facilities. We provided that information on the promise that he would turn over copies of all files gathered from the Cerberus systems to us. Did you have anything to do with Admiral Kahoku ending up dead? We had no reason to harm him. He was going to provide us with information about Cerberus. Information that is now in your possession. You must have some connection to Cerberus. How else could you tell Kahoku where to find them? Information is our business, Commander. Through our contacts, we were able to determine that the Cerberus group was active in the Voyager Cluster. Unfortunately, that was all we were able to find out. That is why we are so interested in acquiring copies of the files from you. These are classified Alliance files. I'm not handing them over to you. Be reasonable, Commander. Cerberus was operating outside Alliance jurisdiction. You don't owe them any loyalty. The Alliance is just going to file this information away in some archive. No secret stays hidden forever. Eventually, someone somewhere will deliver it into our hands. Might as well be you. Transmit the files to us and you will be well compensated. What are you going to do with this information? The information is a commodity. It can be bought, sold, or traded. Why my employer desires this information is not my concern. I am only the buyer. My loyalty is to the Alliance, not the Shadow Broker. That is unfortunate, Commander. My employer will remember this the next time you need something from us. Thank you.